not in bad shape. Check the oil. Oil is good for being old, right? We'll go ahead and give it the old smell test here. Not burnt. Tastes pretty good. That's a good sign. Empty. So yeah, I think that's gonna be if I can't get this running and I gotta get it out of here to my shop, those are not gonna be fun. I'm gonna have to cut them off with the torch. I'm surprised how good the frame is on this. All right, let's open this door slow. You never know if there's wild animals in these trucks that sit. Moss! It's you! How'd you get in here? Was there a hole in the floor, buddy? There's Moss. Breaking this truck in too, huh, pup? There's Moss. Yeah, we can't leave Moss out of the video. All right, well. Looks like uh, there could be some wiring issues here. <sighs> but solid truck. Uh, ow! Oh, it's just crazy how good the frame. Is. Usually these things are rotted out like crazy. Look at that. Huh? This downriggers off. That's a good thing. Let's get these batteries in. And I'm gonna put this power wire here. It looks like it goes there. And then it goes here. I think I already seen it move. It did move. It already moved? Yeah. Alright, well, it's not seized. Nothing. Starter stuff. My Mac got wet. That's right. Your ground wasn't so wet. I don't think I can get it from up there, though.
Here we go, there's the starter. And you can tell they've been banging on that thing for a while. And it's stuck out too, so it's all noise bad. Yeah, playing in the mud out here. All right, I got a new starter. Let's get that back in. All right, there's a brand new starter. New and improved. Uh, yeah, 39 MT. Replaced the 39, or 41 MT. So this is what we're putting in this truck. All right, the new starter's in. See it down there? There it is. New starter's in. And the motor, we checked, it's not frozen. Let's see if this thing turns over. Okay, that's good news. See if there's any in here. I mean, there is. Half full. And that does not look like good fuel. Look at that. That's what you do with old fuel on a filter. It's not going to hurt because I'm going to mix that with new, so just trying to get see how bad this filter is. It doesn't look that dirty. There's no dirt in the bottom of that. It's just kind of yellowish looking. I don't know if... I mean, that's five-year-old fuel, so... I need to hook this up to the truck. Messier than it needed to be, but we got it. Yeah, let's get this filter back in here without spilling. So there's like no good way to do this. Plug on the bottom. This one is full. <clears throat> now it looks like it's leaking now. <sighs> I don't have any new filters. Oh, this, this. I'm worried about this now because I feel like <clears throat> the gasket's probably shot. <clears throat> Hopefully, it doesn't suck air. It's kind of weird there's no fluid in there. Like, why would it be that empty? There's got to be a hose or something. Something's leaking. I don't know what yet. I mean, the antifreeze can stay in the vehicle for a long time. Hopefully it's not a head gasket or something. Moss.
I mean, that's four gallons right there. Okay, we're all the way up here now. I know you got lucky with that. Yeah, right. Buddy, it's gonna start. Maybe not. All right, we have to try to bleed this, but I'm by myself, so how can we do this? I gotta hold that in. Oh, it's so close. I don't wanna break, I, I mean, I need that, so. Almost broke it. Ah, oh, don't break it. Come on, gentle, gentle, gentle. All right, that might work. Right there. You get an air out here to just try to pop, and that's soaked. Do that. All right, I got the screwdrivers out. Moment of truth. Sound like you wanted to go.
guess the next question is, does it move? I mean, I know it's not going to go anywhere, but let's see if the transmission works. Come on.
going back to Rillberry.
the uh, blinker and the windshield wipers come on. Kind of funny. I tell you, the truck actually runs awesome. So that's good news. It's got 81,000 miles on it. I picked it up for two grand. I think everybody was just worried about uh, attacking a project like this. And what's up, bud? And uh, yeah, it's not. this isn't the last time you're gonna see this. Uh, I got plans for this. Uh, I kind of tossing around ideas, but the utility bed's gonna come off. The boom's coming off and I'm gonna put something on the back. It already has a PTO, so that's really cool because it's automatic transmission, and I know those are like four grand. So I feel like I made out all right. Come here. Moss starting to get smart, running away from me. What's in your mouth? Come on, Moss. That looks like money. Come on, Moss. Moss. Get the water bottle. Get it. Oh, you're going to chase that instead. All right. Thanks for watching. And I'll see you on the next one.